This is the Solarec LED lantern slash emergency flashlight. Uh, the, the lantern itself is, comes with the instruction booklet and the car charging plug, which I forgot to put in the screen here. Uh, the instructions are okay, fairly basic. The charging cable itself is a little flimsy. Uh, it's okay, but in the case of this, where you're really mostly using the crank handle for camping or emergency situations, it's not a huge factor uh, in my rating. I would have liked to seen this particular lantern use a micro USB type of plug as opposed to the, the old style uh, port that this cable includes. Um, even with all that, this is a great camping lantern uh, that, you know, you don't need batteries to use. You just turn this hand crank here for five seconds and you have ten minutes of use. You turn it for a minute, you get over an hour. Uh, if you do it for longer, you get a, a longer time of illumination, making this a perfect lantern for emergency situations or out in the woods, camping, that kind of thing. Um, the, if you use the car charger, you can... It'll charge it up to four hours. Uh, very easy to use. Like I said, you just turn the crank here uh, for a little bit of time. Uh, I did this earlier. I'll demonstrate that in a minute. The light uh, with the lights off here. Uh, but you know, and it's very easy to use. It has a button on the side here that allows for uh, light. Uh, if you click it once for the lantern, turn it off, and click it again, it turns on the flashlight. It's very lightweight, easy to handle. It's got a, a pull-out handle here that can be adjusted out to a 90-degree angle for carrying. It's also got at the top here uh, a way to hang it as well. Uh, it's, it's made of plastic. It's, it's very lightweight, but it does seem to be pretty well made and durable. Uh, the light on both ends are surprisingly bright um, and do a pretty good job for emergencies or camping and is can handle being out in a wet situation such as the rain. Uh, the one thing I do wish that it had a little differently on it would be uh, the ability to change the rechargeable battery. Uh, so once it ends its lifespan, I really don't see a way to actually change that battery out. Uh, I'm going to demonstrate now what this looks like with the lights off to show you the illumination. Unfortunately, it's not dark out yet, but I'll show you the illumination anyway. This is the flashlight. Again, you turn it off, you turn it on, and there's the lamp. It gives a pretty good amount of illumination for, uh, you know, the type of device. I mean, again, this is a really good uh, camping light or emergency light. I mean, ignore the misspellings and the poor translations that are on the box and in the instructions because they are kind of poor uh, English translations. But this is a really good... Uh, camping emergency light when there's no electricity uh, available. You just turn the crank and you have light. I give this four and a half stars.